This Packet Tracer Lab is a continuation of a previous Packet Tracer Lab. In the previous lab, you were asked to subnet 192.168.1.0/24 and break it up into subnets for site 1 and site 2, and you were asked to configure subnets on those sites as well as on the serial links. In this lab, you need to subnet the network again to extend and conserve IP addresses. An additional site has been added to the lab, site 3. What you need to do is take the subnet 192.168.1.64.26 and subnet that to support this third site, as well as to reuse the subnet for the three serial connections. Serial links only need a slash 30 mask. So you need to subnet the last new subnet that you get from 192.168.1.64.26 and use slash 30 masks so that you can allocate that subnet to the three serial links. So what you need to do once again is break up 192.168.1.64.26 to support as many subnets as possible with eight hosts per subnet. You need to allocate the first new subnet to site three. So in other words, on the local area network over here, and then take the last new subnet that you get from 192.168.164 and subnet that with slash 30 masks, and then allocate those subnets to the serial links. You need to configure the routers appropriately so this router needs to use the first IP address in the new subnet, this router the last one, and the same is true for the other sites. On the local area network at site three, router four should use the last IP address in the new subnet. The switch, the second last IP address in the subnet, and the hosts should be allocated IP addresses from the first available IP address to the last available IP address. You're gonna configure the IP addresses in this subnet manually. Previously, we used DHCP to allocate IP addresses to PCs, but in this subnet, you're gonna use static IP addresses. Now, once you've configured the network, uh, verify that PCs can access cisco.com and facebook.com using their browsers. Cisco.com and facebook.com are websites on the internet you need to verify that your PCs, PC6, 7, and 8, can access the internet, as well as choose a PC in Site 1 and Site 2, and make sure that they can also access cisco.com and facebook.com. So can you complete this lab? Download the packet tracer file and see if you can complete the lab yourself. Otherwise, watch the next video where I complete the lab.